What's up with it, man? It's your boy Rebuke All Devils coming back at you. And yo, I want to first up, first and foremost give a shout out to Sister uh, CT and Brother JT for sharing this story with me. Uh, check this out. Watch lead investigator Dr. Robert Montgomery explain how the pig kidney human transplant happened. U.S. surgeons say they have successfully given the pig's kidney to a person in a transplant breakthrough they hope could ultimately solve donor organ shortages. The recipient was brain dead, meaning they were already on artificial life support with no prospect of recovering. The kidney came from a pig that had been genetically modified to stop the organ being recognized by the body as foreign and being rejected. So what they doing, family, you know what I'm saying, is playing with dead bodies. So once again, they disrespecting the dead. And now they putting defilable organs off in a dead body. Now we know in the book of Leviticus, it tells us the pig is unclean to us. We are, therefore ye shall not eat it, nor shall ye touch his dead carcass. So a pig is an unclean animal to the most high. And what are these Gentiles doing? They're putting unclean animal parts inside of the human body. That the Most High did not create the body. And it did not come with a pig heart. You see? It did not come with a pig kidney. It did not come with a cow lung. But this is the wickedness that we are seeing right before our eyes. You know? And, you know, we have to stay vigilant. You know what I'm saying? We have to make sure we're keeping the laws, statutes, and commandments. Because I tell you, man... This is like a, a modern day Frankenstein movie, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And it's really a mockery because if you know the scripture, only one person came back from the dead and that was the Messiah. So what are they really trying to do? Are they eventually trying to bring people back to the dead? Drop your comments down below, man. Let me know what y'all think about this. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Don't forget to click on that notification bell. And once again, man, shout out to Sister C uh, CT and Brother JT for sharing this story. Drop them stories down uh, in the email, man. Anything y'all want me to report on that y'all feel is uh, significant and important to us, to the nation, to our people, man, put it in the email, and I'll cover that story for you. Until then, shout out to the wizard.